Here's the latest on xtalks.com. The current opioid epidemic in the U.S. has prompted pharmaceutical companies to develop alternative drugs with diminished abuse potential. Among these drug makers is Nectar Therapeutics, who has announced that their opioid analgesic has met both its primary and secondary endpoint in a recent Phase 3 efficacy study. Hello, I'm Sarah Hand, editor and webinar moderator for xtalks.com, and welcome to this edition of xtalks Vitals. The drug, referred to as NKTR181, is a first-in-class full mu opioid agonist molecule. According to Nectar, the drug provides relief for chronic pain without causing a sense of euphoria. It's this euphoric high that often leads to opioid abuse and addiction. The Phase 3 clinical trial, dubbed Summit 07, investigated the efficacy of twice-daily dosing of NKTR-181 in over 600 patients with chronic low back pain. These patients categorized their pain as either moderate or severe, and none of the participants in the study had ever used opioid drugs before. The drug met its primary endpoint of significantly improving back pain over the placebo. Secondary endpoints were also met, which included statistically significant reduction in pain in a proportion of study participants. Low back pain is a common cause of disability in the U.S., which is responsible for an estimated $100 to $200 billion in lost wages, lower productivity, and other costs. It's estimated that 19% of the U.S. population suffers from chronic pain, according to a 2014 study published in the American Pain Society's The Journal of Pain. Subscribe to the Xtalks YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button below and visit xtalks.com for more information on this story and others like it in the life science industry.